You might have heard before that brown sugar is healthier than white sugar. After all, it holds true for brown rice. Part of this myth might come from the colour, since raw sugar is typically brown as well, and could lead to some people believing that brown sugar is less processed and refined than white, and therefore healthier but while brown sugar isn't exactly the same as white sugar, there's really not much difference between the two when it comes to nutrition. Usually molasses is what gives all brown sugars their colour. The browner it is, the more molasses it contains, but according to the experts, rather than being less processed, most of the brown sugar you might buy at the grocery store has been refined to white sugar and then had molasses added back in it to give manufacturer more control over the crystal size and colour. Mixing in molasses does add a few nutrients to white sugar that otherwise aren't there including calcium, iron and potassium, but they're in such a small amount that they don't really add any extra health benefits to brown sugar. Brown sugar is only 5-10% to molasses, so there just isn't enough there to make it significantly different from white sugar when it comes to nutrition. Instead of switching out white sugar for brown, it's best to just use each one in moderation. The difference between baking with white sugar and brown sugar. While you won't gain any health benefits from swapping the two, since they're so similar you can sometimes substitute one for the other in recipes without noticing much of a difference. For example, if you're out of brown sugar, you can substitute an equal amount of white sugar, though your baked goods might be a little less moist. You can also swap white sugar for brown sugar, though it can make for slightly denser baked goods, which may not work well for light and airy cakes. But if you're set on using brown sugar to make chocolate chip cookies, and you've only got white sugar in your pantry, you can easily mix up your own. One cup of white sugar mixed with one tablespoon of molasses makes light brown sugar and increasing the molasses to two tablespoons will give you dark brown sugar. It's not nearly as easy to create your own white sugar from brown sugar, but hey, that's what grocery delivery is for, right?